when I was a child, my family told me that I had a problem. Uh, it's called the Poland syndrome, and it affects my right uh, pec and my arm. So I don't have a pec and I don't have an arm. So uh, when I started playing with toys, uh, my father uh, bought me a Lego Titanic. So I built it alone uh, at the age of five. Uh, not exactly, but at the age of five. So it was the first time I played with Legos. As a child, I was like uh, very nervous to be in front of other guys uh, because I was different. But that didn't stop me believing in my dreams, and I wanted to do what I was thinking about. And it was uh, seeing myself in front of the mirror, like I see other guys with uh, two hands. So at the age of 18, last year, I built this pr this prosthetic. I call it the MK1. People think that because you have no hand, you're different from the others, or if because you are fat, uh, you can't be your uh, you can be a friend. So, yeah, every time I go to a conference, I talk about this, and I see cases of real uh, bullying in schools, and I see guys uh, asking for help. And as I was telling. This is very heavy in my arm, but it's like 11 grams, so it's nothing to you. But I can feel it a lot in my arm. This is the first prosthetic. I call it the MK1 because it looks like an Iron Man arm. And it's pure mechanical. I can move it like this. And I mean, it's very easy. It's a very easy mechanism. It's just like uh, two uh, um, like uh, cords in here that tie when I close the arm. And well, this is a this is the simplest one I built. If I was born with two hands, now I wouldn't be sitting here uh, telling you that I can help um, many other people with my problem or even if it's mental illness or something else um, because this, I would call it thing, but it's not a thing, but this thing um, helped me as well because I can understand how people feel when they feel bad about themselves My main dream is to finish my university, that's first, but then I would like to go somewhere uh, creating prosthetics for people that can't afford uh, a real prosthetic, like it costs, it's very expensive, but I would try to give them a prosthetic, even if it's for free, um, to make them feel uh, like a normal person, because what is normal, right? So like a normal person.